Clouds are wet this morning, but the good news is for your commute shouldn't have much in the way of new precipitation. Maybe just a couple sprinkles, a little bit of drizzle in the areas where we can get a little bit of condensation going, but otherwise the satellite picture just showing some clouds along Interstate 80 there improving along 80 up into the Sierra and Highway 50 as well. I would still expect some slow spots until we get to late this morning into the early afternoon. Once the sun comes up, we should see plenty of it down to the surface, not a whole lot of cloud cover, so that sun is going to start to do some good work and really help those crews out getting those roads clear. But again, first half of the day, probably still some slow going, especially in those spots that picked up two, three, four feet of snow over the last couple of days. Great to see that though, right? Satellite uh, picture of the wide view showing what's left of our storm system. That's dropping to the south behind it. The cooler air is flowing in temperatures today just slightly below average. It's going to feel a little bit milder today compared to the last couple of days just because we will have a little bit more sunshine. Still have a cool north breeze though coming out of the northwest at about five to ten miles per hour through this afternoon. But notice we should see plenty of sunshine. So once that sun does come up, the roads are still wet. Yeah, you're going to get a pretty strong sun glare off the roads, especially if you're driving in the easterly direction. Uh, but future cast shows that through this morning, the trend is for the sky to continue to clear out. We'll stay clear through this afternoon. Maybe a few scattered clouds as you go up into the foothills in the high Sierra. But again, not expecting any new snowfall accumulation there outside of a few flurries. Six o'clock Tuesday morning. Look at this. Future cast picking up on a little bit of fog that may be starting to develop in the San Joaquin Valley that will deepen as we get into about eight or nine o'clock in the morning. So do expect some travel slowdowns along parts of I-5 tomorrow morning between Stockton and Sacramento. There may be some smaller areas of fog in the Sacramento Valley and out towards the Delta as well. We see it every time it rains, the sky clears out, the temperatures drop. We get the fog for a couple of days, and that's going to be the case until we can really start to dry the ground out, which we do have a few dry days coming up here. But as we go through Tuesday afternoon, again, the sky stays clear. Look at this too. Temperatures tomorrow morning starting off in the low to mid 30s through the valley. So there may be even some spots of some freezing fog as you go a little bit higher up. That is something we will have to watch for for tomorrow. So much cooler and visibility not nearly as good as what it will be for this morning. And that trend for cooler weather, that's going to hang on for at least the next couple of days. Temperatures overall as we go through this week, staying in the low 50s. We'll see a mix of clouds and sunshine today, Tuesday, Wednesday. Looks like we stay dry all the way through this week, so getting at least a little bit of a break. But Teo and Deirdre, really nice to see the rainy season getting off to such a good yeah. start.